guys, welcome or welcome back. It is Black Pearl Staples here, and today we are going to be doing an unboxing tour. A tour, a haul. Sorry. Also, they did not come in this bag, but they came in all different, like, boxes, and I just put them in this bag. I only, I looked at them through the bag, but I didn't open them, but one came in only bubble wrap. So I did open that one, but I put them back in the bubble wrap for y'all. So, okay. Oh, this is the first one. This is the thoroughbred stallion. Um, I think it's a stallion. I don't know if it's a stallion or a galvan, but yeah. So I have to find something to like you know hold my phone. But first I'll put in the straight up. Actually I'll just get something real quick. I have something holding it up. So I'm gonna move this back. So everything in this that I got is all of it is like now some of them might be retired and I got them off of an online store in where I am so guess where I am and if anyone comments after I post the next video revealing what um, country I'm in then that won't count but yeah whoever gets yeah guess what country I'm in, it's in Europe, uh, yeah, guess what it is, so, riding with Nella, Huffield Stables, Nella's Jazz Venture, and Nella on Two Fabulous Equines, please don't comment, because you know, but yeah, I'm literally obsessed with him, I love that shading, he's so pretty, he's like, such a little stunner i love his um like pose too i love this model overall i think it's just a really nice model um yeah i'm just literally obsessed with him so then we're gonna do the next horse so the next horse we're gonna pull out is this boy i think he's retired now um this is the retired clydesdale stallion uh yeah i think he is building but i'm gonna use him as a stallion because well, yeah. so yeah he is such a stunner look, look at this he is so pretty oh so sorry the lighting is not it but um, wait let me try to get this off wait what why are we still here just a supper Oh my god, I actually can't get them off. Wait, what? Why can't I get this off? Wait, okay. I think I got it. Oh, okay, I got it. Okay. So, this is the... That's not a scratch. So, he has a little thing on his cheek, but I don't mind it. Because, well, he's retired. And he's definitely been sitting in a warehouse for a long time. Plus... I could just, it looks very, like, big on camera, but it's actually, like, really small. And I could just paint it the color he is, so it's not really a problem for me. So, yeah, I love him. I used to have this model before I started YouTube, and then I literally, like, gave away all my shit, like, to my, no, I didn't. What am I talking about? Um, I... I got. I know. I got him at Toys R Us. As like uh, one, like my second ever like. But then I don't know what happened to him. I just don't have him anymore. So I'm really happy. I got my own new model. Also, I love the little pose. Like I love him. When I was a kid, I didn't understand this, but a lot of um quads does have it. It's like thing. I thought it was like part of his hair, but now he looks like so much better. Like if they had like a version where you could take that out, that'd be so sweet. Cause I'm like, why is that part of his hair? It ruins his whole look. And now I love how his hair is put. 
thick. I love it. He looks so much better on camera than on video. He looks so much better in real life than on video. It does not do him justice. His coat color is literally stunning. I love him. But anyway, let's get on to the next horse. So I'm going to randomly pull out of the bag. And yeah, whoever I get out of the bag, we open. So I'm also sorry if it's like terrible. I have something holding my phone up. But I'm gonna see, I'm not even looking. <gasps> okay, I was kind of hoping I'd get her before a different horse, and I'm happy I got her. So this is the Pintail Mare, or the Paint Mare. Cause Pintail is a coat color, um, paint is a braid, so. I'm afraid for a smurdy expert. Okay, put that over there. Also, don't mind, I'm gonna throw like all the garbage out, but I'm so happy I got her because I love the, like the Palomino color. I know I had her at some point, but just like him, I don't know what happened. Maybe like I gave them away or something. Cause I remember I gave like a few of my horses away to my friend. So maybe I gave her to her hair? I don't know, actually. But yeah, I love her little rosy um, pink muzzle. I think that's just so cute. And I love, like, the way she's walking. It's, like, such a sassy walk. But now let's get out the next horse. Okay, so I still... Oh, okay. This is one of the new 2024 horses. And I decided to only get one. What? Jeez. Okay. I decided. I already have a few 2024 horses. I have both of the fjords and the the um, the Frisian foal. But now I have this guy, and I've literally, when I first saw him come out, I'm like Harry Potter. So I think I'm gonna do like. A Harry Potter name for him because look at that little lightning bolt. Whenever I first saw him and like, like you know those like, well, for him it was like 2024 horses. It was like in like November before they even got released, or no, it was in like September. Whenever I first saw him, I was obsessed with him, and I'm kind of confused why like could have gotten him before but they were all sold out on this like website the only one they had was the Frasian full because people go crazy in the beginning of the year so yeah we got him and then oh this is two i think oh my god okay this is the one in bubble wrap yeah and then we have one after that okay so this is the one in bubble wrap the bubble wrap has like come out on the bag but whatever okay so I love him. I know I do have this Arabian, but my dog ate his ears, and I'm going to customize the other one. Also, the other one is not in good condition, so I decided why not get him. Also, he was on stock, and I love him. Um, and he's just, I love the coat color. Like, he does not look that good on camera, actually. He looks more like a bay when he's kind of, like, grayish, I guess. I, I wish... I, I'm really hoping, because I'm going to have lessons here, I really hope they have a horse that looks like this at the barn. Because I've always wanted to ride an Arabian that's like a light bay grayish. So I've always wanted to ride one of those, and he's literally, like I hope. Because he's literally like a horse I would love to ride, but yeah, let's get on with the last horse, which is... I'm different from the rest, but still very cool. So, yeah. Wait, did I get anything else? I feel something else in here. No, that's the last one. Yes, I got the um, paint fold. I got the full. I got the mat and full. So, I have the mat and full now. I've never had the full before, so this is going to be like... I haven't had a lot of these guys, but... Oh my god. I have like never seen her in store or anything. I'm literally obsessed with her 
She is so cute. She looks like so adorable and little. I didn't move my camera down. Oh my god. I'm so sorry guys. I know the quality is not it. But yeah, so here is all my horses. So we have my mare in full. Um put name ideas in the comments down below. Um this is my mare in full. And yeah, I really love them. And then this is my Arabian gelding. This is my thoroughbred gelding. I don't think I'm going to cut that out because then you're going to be like, why don't you stop talking? But yeah, this is my thoroughbred stuff. I don't know if he's a stallion or gelding, but well. Then we have my Clydesdale, which I love him so much more now. When I was younger, I thought he looked like ugly with things in his hair, which I think they may, well, I think it's really unique how they did add that because, like, not many, not any, actually, other slug horses um, that I know have that. So I think that's just a really, really cool thing that they added to this guy, just to make him a little more special and a little more of a treat for us. But yeah, and then our final horse is this guy. I think I'm definitely naming him after Harry Potter. The first time I saw him, I'm like, Harry. But I don't think I'm going to name him Harry. The crazy thing, I don't even watch Harry Potter, but um, whatever. Because I know Harry Potter has a thing on his head. Okay, whatever. The quality is not it. Yeah. I know he has the thing on his head. Now the quality is literally giving. Because, yeah, I got him new, like, from... It's, um... The 14, I had the 13 before. So it has more storage, too. It was a longer video. Like, I always, I always used to be scared of my storage filling up. Oh, I always used to fill up. And now I don't have so much more storage. And the quality is, like, so much better. <clears throat> but, yeah. Um... Put names... In, well, I'm probably going to look at my video I posted, like, like horse name ideas, but if I, you think, well, I definitely didn't put a Harry Potter name in there, which, so, definitely not going to do him. I feel like I might name him Draco, or Malfoy, because I don't know why, but he reminds me of Draco Malfoy. Yeah, I, I, I see Harry Potter edits all the time, you guys. I know, like, the sound like the carpenter's name like i know that owl's name but i forgot it i think it starts with an h but i forgot so yeah bye guys i hope you enjoyed um please like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one oh so very prepared for so many videos because they have such a big fenced in like backyard it's like being obsessed but yeah um yeah go on to my other channel for more updates because i'm going to be writing way more than striking because i have lessons five days a week i just don't have it on weekends which is really opposite because i only have the lesson on saturday at home which i'm really excited to write five times a week i'm going to be here for almost four weeks so that's like a lot of lessons but yeah guys Bye, I hope you like and subscribe, and I'm going to edit this, like, right now and post it right now, but, yeah. So, you're probably going to see this, like, however long this, well, I'm still going to edit it. Probably, like, tonight. I'm going to post it tonight. It's going to literally be, like, 1 p.m. for you guys, though. No, it's going to be, like, 3 p.m. for you guys. So, it's not going to be night, but it's going to be night here, because it's so totally different. Also, giving you hints for guessing where it is. What country I am in Europe in the um, comments? So, yeah, definitely make sure to go like check that out. But, anyways, bye, guys. See you guys in the next one.